going on so we're showing off my saw collection part one it's going to be a saw one to three so we're just going to start off and dive right into it because i have so many editions so starting at saw one we have the australian basic edition this is the regular unrated or director's cut version from the us it's a pretty nice uh cover stone cover i actually love the look of this it's the front it's the back sorry about the little glare there yep and the disc just regular unrated special features, nothing interesting, just basic standard Australian coffee. So that is that one. That's saw one Australian. Alright, getting on to the US version. I'm just gonna try and fly through all these so this video isn't that long. So saw US edition theatrical, epic slip cover, there's the front. There's the back. You can probably see the features just there. I'll bring that up close to the camera, pause it if you want to read it there. And you know the spine. I'll show you the spine smart as well, so it's is fine. And it's got the exact same on the other side there. So this is regular theatrical Saw 1 edition. Got a nice little disc there. Nice little leg. Pretty sick. Alright. Now I do really love the US slip covers. That's uh, it's just one of the best things about collecting all the Saw movies. Just love that. Alright, now we have the Canadian uncut edition from Saw 1. Two discs basically the exact same as the uh, dual case uncut edition this is just from canada so yeah there's the front there's the back bunch of special features pause it if you want to read them and disc one which is just the feature disc two all the special features pretty simple epic design that's that all right saw so jewel case right here there's a big crack on it it's just old so yeah, basically this is like, this used to be like liquid red water in there, and, you know, to look like blood. You could like just move stuff around, so have a little saw blade in there, try and move that around. Yeah, sometimes it doesn't want to move because it's old, so. Oh. All right, don't worry about that. There we go, we got it. All right, uncut edition saw, jewel case, exact same as regular uncut I just showed you. Disc, this one, got Amanda in the reverse bear trap just there. And disc two. I think I love the artwork that they added in, it's pretty, pretty cool. Alright, that's the jewel case. And we have the Saw 1 regular Blu-ray edition. Australian release. Um, this does not have any special features on whatsoever. It kind of sucks. So it's just the film and that's it. No menu. I think there is a menu, but you have to watch the film first because it won't make any plays. But yep, regular unrated edition Saw 1 Blu ray, and that's about it. Pretty cool disc, nice little artwork, Big Master. It's pretty decent. We're getting towards the end of Saw, so here is the Saw 1 Steelbook. I believe it's from the Netherlands. Yeah, Netherlands, I'm assuming. So very plain, very very minimalistic. I actually really enjoy the minimalistic stuff from Saw, so there's that, it's a spine. There's the hand. Back. Open that up a bit. Alright, so steel edition, we've got a little booklet here, we've got disc one, disc two, so disc one's just a film and some special features, like you know, probably like a trailer and commentary. And everything else is all in here, like the yeah, music videos, all that on disc two. I believe this is also just regular, unrated as well. I mean, I could be wrong. I've not viewed this edition in a while. And it has this little book here. It's just advertised for other steel books. So we got that, Saw 4. Scandinavian, that's it. This is the Scandinavian edition. There we go. All right, so that's the Saw 1 steel book. Scandinavian, I believe. Alright, then we've got the Zabby Exclusive UK Saw Edition. This is basically the special edition. I got this really cheap. They're doing a massive clear out like a year or two ago for like six bucks per steelbook. So I was like, yeah, I'll get one. It's got all the special features there. It's fine. That's the key thing over there. J cards. Oh, that's a hard one. Now we have this sort of special edition, and I'll take this out. So I'm 
viral looking thing. Pretty like it's pretty decent artwork. But yeah, just flying through this as fast as I can. Pack with special features. Not really that rare, you can probably find this on eBay. Relatively cheap, so there's that one. And then we have the Saw 10th Anniversary Steelbook, probably one of my favourite versions or additions of the Saw, or the Saw 1 movie. So 10th Anniversary Steelbook, Saw Director's Cut, it says it right down there, that focuses. We have the Saw Spine, got a little tiny plastic paper like J card on the back, so it's German, it's a German release. Blood Red, German release, Kino World Blu-ray. This is probably one of my favourites, so there's the disc. Should I take that out? There's not really much artwork, all the artworks behind the um, special stuff that you get here, which I will be going through. That down. So it comes with a uh, few postcards, basically poster like things. You can get these all in like posters online. So we've got the Saw, Amanda Young, Sean Smith with their Fair Trap. We've got that again, just different versions of the artwork. Got this one, I also have a poster of this one, so I'll show that in a later video. I like this one a lot. I just wanted to show you the back too. All of them have this little saloon, so it's like really a puppet up there, it's pretty, pretty funny. Dr. Gordon reaching for his phone. And then Billy the Puppet on the good old tricycle. And then lastly in this we have the a small like flyer poster I guess you could say. It's not really like massive but it is relatively big. So I'm gonna have to like fold it down so it's just a sort of 10th anniversary poster. Like this. Oh man, I wish I had more video space. But yeah, it's just a poster and then you have the leader puppet in the background there. It's pretty nice artwork. And it's one of my favourite versions, or oh, haunted versions, one of my favourite Saw release editions. So I'm just going to put these all back in order. What is that one? On to the last one for Saw 1. It is the Saw limited collector's edition, or just regular collector's edition. This is the first version. Saw 1 media book from Kinewelt, Germany. Probably one of the best one of the best things you can possibly get. The media books are so packed with special features and a lot of like a lot of artwork. So this front and the back. Show the spine as well. I'll take it out of its epic little slip there. So move that away. Now the best thing about this one, honestly, it comes with both saw theatrical and saw director's cut. So this is the theatrical disc, this is the director's cut disc. I'll just show you. Kind of the song's just regular theatrical or censored. And then director's cut, pretty good. I'll get to the artwork in a minute. And it also comes with the Saw 1 original motion picture soundtrack. Soundtrack, my bad. So, yeah, it's pretty decent that they came with the Saw CD. This is the only one that did come with it. The Saw 2 onwards media books never came with the Saw CD, which sucks because that would have made like even better. And this little atom there. I'll just skim through all of this. It's all in German. I'm not really native to German, but I can probably like translate some words. So yeah, we've got the um, basically the DVD chapter menu there. The um, comparing like the DVD extras. So we got the um, director's cut ones. We've got those ones, and then basically all of these. Tracklist, these are all the tracklist from the CD this comes with. Can, I'll try and get it all on camera there. There we go. I'll just keep going past. So there's Zep, some nice little artworks and pictures. Bathroom Adam. Commander at the top there, Adam again. John Kramer, Tobin Bell, laying in the uh, blood. The OG Jeff, in the fucking wheelchair. Tap, Gordon. Gordon's wife. Ooh, James Wan. Behind the scenes picture there. Soundtrack, Charlie Clouser. 
my man. Oh, six pages, more text. Just more of that. Cast crew, basically credits. There we got like the most iconic thing of just Adam realizing that John was like you know not dead the whole time. You know, Jigsaw Killer. And there we go. That's the media book. Really lovely collector's item. Would highly recommend if you can ever come across with. They're pretty pricey, but I was like, I get this one and saw it for relatively cheap. So yeah, there's that. I'm back with Saw 2. We'll start the regular Australian release right here. So it's just Saw 2 regular. It's basically the, uh, I believe it's the theatrical version. I've not seen this version in a while. I just usually keep the unrated Blu-ray. So yeah, there's that. So come back. Spine. Nothing really interesting about it. Not even the discard, I'm not really a fan of the discard, if I'm being brutally honest, but yeah, there's that one. Alright, Saw 2. I believe it's the US one. Or is this now? Is it a Canadian version? Basically, the regular theatrical version of Saw 2. Nice epic slip. Love the artwork for this. Beats the um, Saw 2 I just showed you. Pretty decent artwork. Sorry about the glare. Spine. And you know, since the slips have the spine on that side too. Basic disc is disc is alright, but yeah, just regular theatrical version of Saw 2 right here. Again, love the slip covers. Alright, moving on to a very great edition right here, the Saw 2 Special 2 Disc Edition. So basically the director's cut, which is basically the unrated version anyway. You got the front and the back. I'll show you the um it has a little anamorphic thing, so you have the key just here. It's hard to do on camera, but yeah, you can see just there. It's pretty cool. Alright, and... Nice little slip. The actual edition right here, just to um, clarify, it's basically the unrated version, it has unrated there. You can get this in the director's cut, but they're like literally the exact same. So, exact same 2 disc edition, feature film disc 1, disc 2, a lot of special features and a little bonus game, which is pretty nice. So yeah, if you want to read the special features, I'll try and get a good camera angle. Just pause it right there if you want to read them. And I'll move on to the next. These aren't really that rare. You can find them on eBay. They're pretty uncommon, but they're not really, like, really, really rare. Unlike the media books. Alright, Saw 2 Blu-ray Australian. This is basically the unrated version. It says uncut here, but it's equivalent to the unrated version anyway. So there's that. Spine back, special features right there, saw two disc, Blue the puppet, nice little artwork there, pretty nice. Now for the um, Blu-ray Australians, it's just, yeah, advertisement right there, oh, Blu-ray is so superior, well, alright, so that's saw two Australian Blu-ray. Alright, next we've got the Steelbook, saw two, I believe it's a Scandinavian Steelbook as well. So there's the front, really love the artwork, love the red saw too, love the fingers, little tagline there. Two disc again, like saw one, and for some reason they have the leg there. Nice spine, love the look of that spine there. Dive right into it here. Alright, so we got the saw two disc, which is just the film and a few such features. Then we have the bonus material disc right here, which is just a lot of like trailers and other stuff like that, music videos, trailers. And there's that. Unfortunately, there are no, there is no background. It's just old steel background. More advertisements right here. It's the exact same as the saw one steel work I showed you. All right, that's that one. Next up, I just got this today. So yeah, I got this today so I can finally film this video. So you got the saw two Spanish edition, the censored edition, which is basically the theatrical version. Plus, you know, some censored stuff, so they like cut out probably like certain bits in the film. So there is that. There's a the front. A lot of stuff going on in the front. You got the disc, got the saw two censored, a lot of text. Ugh. Honestly, I think the cover's a mess, but it's still a pretty nice steel book. Oh yeah, I forgot for some reason it's upside down. The spine is like the wrong way. Because usually it should be that way and saw two should be facing up that way, but for some reason it's upside down. And we have the disc, which is just the film, and it comes with like, well, like a few special features. And then we have the extras disc right here. And nice little artwork of 
hobby in the oven. So yeah, there's that. I just love how they did all the extras with all the fingers there, so oh, it's pretty hilarious. I'll just that. Alright, this is going to be a very, very long video, and it's only part one. So, Saw 1 and 2 Limited Seal Edition. This is from Germany. So, Kino Welt, Lionsgate, DVD, pretty much just down there. So, there's the front. There's the spine. It's not anamorphic like the Saw 2 one, it's just a steel book. I love the look of this. It's really nice deal book. So it comes with the Soul 1 and Soul 2 direct it's kind of a bunch of special features. Of course if you want to read the special features there because I'm going to look through this. There's a picture of Adam's corpse up there. Do you believe Adam's alive? Yeah just, just stop. So Soul 1, Soul 2 extras. I'll take this disc out to show you the artwork. It's the exact same as that Spanish edition basically. A little bit more bloodier. Oh come on. There is that. Just come back in there. Diving right into the Saw 2 media book, the last time in the Saw 2 collection, or Saw 2 editions I have, media book, limited collection edition up here, Saw 2, Michael, little puzzle piece there, doesn't really lead to anything but it's just a pretty cool aesthetic of the um, media book, front, back, special features of course if you want to read it, spine, and I'll take it out of the little slip there, so there's the front, and there is the back, saw blade there, and there is the spine. So opening it, has a little advertising booklet there, I won't get much into that, so Saw 2, it's got the film just here, I believe this is the theatrical version, and then it has just a lot of special features on disc 2 there, and removing the disc for here, has a little bit of artwork there, over here, I'm sure it actually has artwork on the side, on that does, Eric Matthews, of course, one of the best cops. <laughs> now I'll just do a little skim of the booklet here. So it's store to DVD extras, DVD basically chapters. Nice little Billy puppet picture right there. Michael, just keep going on. Behind the scenes stuff. More behind the scenes stuff. Production. Sean Smith there, oh, maybe Xavier smashing the door. And we've got some nice artwork stills, I guess I could say. Stills right here. And I'll just keep going. That's still just there. And yeah. Advertising the Saw 2 original score and the Saw 2 original motion picture soundtrack, both of which I own. I'll eventually get onto them in a later version of this and yeah for some reason it's got cut off here so I'm not sure why that's that but yep that's a Saw 2 media book all right now I'll just get into Saw 3 all right I'm just realizing now this is going over like 20 minutes so I'm just gonna rush through this so Saw 3 Australian release uncut basically unrated version front back Fine. Disc, so Saw 3 regular unrated, regular special features from the Saw 3 unrated disc. Done. Alright, Saw 3, we've got the theatrical full screen edition right here. So another slip cover, really love the slip covers, as you probably don't even know. Probably already know. Front, back, and uh, this one did come with a film cell. These come with like random Saw stuff, you get it like in random Saw editions, like it just comes with like random ones. So a little cell there. John and Amanda. Cool, authenticity, it's my number, all that. Yep, and that is that one. I'll just put this back in and go on to the next one. Doing the right of course. Alright, Saw 3, unrated edition, basic standard, unrated. Another slip cover, different colours. Back, special features. These are mostly all the special features you get on all versions of Saw 3, because I think Director's Coach has a lot of special features. 
slip disc. Yep, disc. Simple. That one. Next, we've got the Source Me Uncut Edition, basically the Canadian version uncut, exact same as unrated. Like, there's like no differences whatsoever. Well, this is widescreen, the other one I believe is full screen. The covers are slightly different, but that's about it. Now we get to the best one of all the Source 3 Director's Cut, probably the best version of Source 3 ever. So, yep, very nice slip cover here, very blue, got the chains, two disc edition. Pause it if you want to read. Actually, no, I'll take it out of the slip so you don't have to glare that much. Focus. Yep. Pause if you want to read the special features just there. Very nice. All right, disc one and disc two. Bunch of special features. Best version of Saw Three would highly recommend. These are pretty common. Just go to like go on eBay, go online, go to a DVD shop. You would definitely find this. All right, Saw Three. Australian uncut, basically unrated, Blu-ray, special features, exact same, spine, disc, billy, alright, I saw three Australian Blu-ray, next, oh well, we have one of the best ones, saw three steelbook, this is the Dutch version, so the best in the series, saw three, love this cover, teeth, oh it's just, it's just so amazing. Got the spine here, says Tobin Bell, Saw 3, Shawnee Smith. On the back. Oh yeah, and also this one, the, the, the um, ticket for Saw 4. So, yeah, just not really use, you can't really use it now, but it's just pretty nice, you know. You know, say you have one. So I'll actually take that out and show some of the artwork. So disc 1 basically just has the movie, disc 2 has a bunch of special features. And basically the back of this is just all blood, a blood splatter. There you go. Saw 3, Dutch, well, Netherlands, Dutch Netherlands edition. Steelbook, which I'll be getting onto again in a second, because I got the ultra rare linear edition numbered one, so that's that one. Really love the look of this steelbook, would highly recommend getting one of these as well if you can. All right, getting on to one of my favorite editions of all time, the Saw 3 2-disc. Mine is number 3740 out of 4000. So basically, you get this, you get one with the three golden teeth and you win a trip to Hollywood. That's basically that. Take it out. That's that, that's the box art. I might as well show it to you, so it's front. The spine is the exact same on the other side and the back. So yeah, this is basically a blood pack as well, it's all dried up, it's, it's red but you know it's all dried up so I can't really you know, do anything much with that. So yep, that's that. Right, then we got back to the steel book again, let's do a quick showcase of it, it's the exact same except there's a lot of good stuff inside. So we'll start off, has saw three teeth, little plastic rubbery like teeth, not real obviously because you would do that. And it has a Saw 3 exclusive collectible poster. Well, I'm not going to say collectible, just like the Legends Never Die poster. This is too big to put on camera, so bear with me. Now, the thing about this poster was it actually had Tobin Bell's blood, like actually in the ink. Oh, man, you cannot see that, but there. Had Tobin Bell's blood mixing with the red ink, and up here it says Legends Never Die. You can't really read it because. I don't have much uh, video space, but yeah, that's that. Alright, and I'll just fold right back in here. I'll put the teeth on the front, like that, that's how it should be. And that's the Saw 3 Extremely Rare 2 Disc Edition Blood Pack. Individually numbered Blood Pack Edition, I guess. I won't put it back there, just have a few seconds. Alright, so lastly for the Saw 3 stuff, Saw 3 Media Book. This is the theatrical, you can get this or the unrated one. I unfortunately got the theatrical. I thought I was getting the unrated one because that was the picture, but theatrical. So, yeah, bad luck for me. So, yeah, there's that. There's the back. It's fine. There you go. Take it out of its little slip there. Saw 3, teeth. And the back. Now, the thing that sucks about this one 
Well, the one that I got is that it's broken. The actual booklet is not really attached. I got some more advertisements. So the booklet, yeah, wasn't attached. It should be stapled in here, in here, but yeah. Very disappointed, but overall it's a pretty decent media book. I just got a very shitty used edition version, whatever. So let's get skim past these. The stills, behind the scenes, all that good stuff. Again, German, King of Welt. And there is that. So since I won't really do that, so two discs, disc ones, just the film, theatrical version, disc two, bunch of extras. So there's that, you got Token Bell. You got Troy. So you glare, there we go, you got Troy there. And I'll attempt to put this back together. I'm just realizing that this is a very, very long video. It's only 30 minutes. Damn. Alright, now last but not least, since I'm, I'm doing Saw 1 to 3, I've got the Saw Trilogy just here. This is the US version, the 3D puppet box face. So you've got the front, spine, back, oh, down the glare. So six discs, a bunch of special features, all three movies, all the best versions of them too. And yeah, I'll just get in there and show you what it's like. Billy, nice 3D looking Billy, pretty creepy. There you go. Back the exact same. There's nothing on the side. And then once you get past that, you have this again. You have Billy again. That's three times. So trilogy. That one there. And there's a little advertising for a little Billy puppet statue. Not really. You can't really get one anymore because you know the links are dead. But there you go. Now it's got the Saw Uncut Edition, basically the ones I showed you from Saw 1, the exact same. Saw 2, Special Edition. Unrated and Saw 3 Director's Cut, the best version. So yeah, that'll do it for the Saw 1 to 3 collection video. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll be doing a Saw 4 to 6, maybe Saw 4 to 7 for part 2. Because I just really need to showcase all my collection, then you know, maybe Saw 7, Jigsaw, then all my props posters and all my other memorabilia that I have. So yep, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. This is a just basically my Saw One, my Ultimate Saw Collection Part One, which is just Saw One to Three. So I'll probably see you in the next one. Not sure when I'll do that next one. Maybe in a couple weeks, maybe a month. See you whenever I get my Saw Grology in. So yep, yeah, have a good one and see you next time.